Today we found out that this is Willa's last day of Kita. How stinking adorable. Ready to go outside. Okay. And is this you over here watering the plants? Oh my goodness, you are. And what are you doing over here? Daddy, start the song. <laughs> Happy first day of Kita to you. Going to Kita today. Yeah! Yay! Woo! High fives. Ready? Set. Set. Go! Today we found out that this is Willa's last day of Kita. We completely forgot. Back in January, they gave us the calendar of the year, and we knew August was when Germans take their summer vacations. But for whatever reason, we forgot, and we dropped them off at Kita, and they're like, yeah, so we'll see you in September. And not only that, but Will is gonna be going to kindergarten. So <laughs> there's a lot of emotions that come with this. Will has had one day to go and experience kindergarten with those five other kids that are gonna be joining her from Kita to kindergarten. And that first experience was great. What is it? Willa, do you wanna tell me about Kita today? Great. What did you do? I play with my friends. Did you play with new friends? Mm -hmm. And did you have a new teacher? Um, I had to do my happy days. You're happy? Yeah. I'm a little bit nervous to see how she transitions because this past week, for whatever reason, I have no idea, but she's just been walking into Kita a little solemn. She's got like her head down, just feeling a little timid. One day she even cried and gosh, still as someone who's moved over to Germany, it just is hard to see your child just struggle, right? Of course, every parent goes through that and it's sad and you just want them to like love it and love it every day. But that's just the reality that comes. They're not gonna love every day. So I'm a little nervous for when she starts kindergarten, especially with the break. The break comes at a really good time though because Tanner's parents are going to be here for two weeks out of August. So it's perfect because Willa would have missed those days of Kita anyways. In September though, my grandparents are coming. So unfortunately she's gonna miss a couple weeks as well. We're doing a really big road trip. Oh, so excited for you guys to see that. So she's gonna miss a little bit, which is going to probably make that adjustment harder. That's for sure a con of travel, of just having family visit and not being home. But Willa can do it, we know she can, we have faith in her, and we're just excited to see how this next stage comes and see how she does. What is it, Willa? Is it a flower? Okay, let's read it. It says, Lieber Willa, jetzt bist du groß und musst bald gehen. Drum nagen wir, sagen wir, auf Wiedersehen. Look, it's a picture of a sunflower, huh? Boy, would rather have a pointer Tanner went in and picked Willa from Kita and they came out with this, you guys. How stinking adorable. Oh my. Now we're gonna go together. Okay, Willa's so excited. Show us what you made. We've seen none of this. What is it? Is that a crab? Oh, that's so awesome. Conrad the crab. And you drew that picture. Oh, it's cute. They have the dates on them too. Yeah. Oh, what's that? Is that a potato? Or is that an egg? Easter. Mm. What's this called for? What is it? That was with us. do that. It looks like a witch. Ready to go outside. Okay. Are you in the garden? <laughs> and and is this you over here watering the plants? Oh my goodness, you are. And what are you doing over here? Wow. Are you playing with Play-Doh? Yeah. Oh, this makes me so happy that she goes. <laughs> Princess oh. dress. What is an old princess dress? It's so big. <laughs> For carnival. People come, people go. Some things never change. I have felt with all my heart. The love I 
can't explain. <laughs> With a love blowing out a candle, huh? Okay, hey, Daddy, start the song. Yeah. <laughs> Happy first day of Kita to you. Going to Kita today. Today is gonna be a Akita today. You're going to make some new friends and play lots of games. And when you're all done, you'll get to come home again. Mommy and Daddy will be there waiting for you. You can do it again. Yeah! Woo! High fives. <laughs> Mommy and Daddy love you. Today's going to be such a fun day. We're so excited for you to go to Kita today. Which sticker should we put on your shirt? Those are really awesome looking penguins, huh? Do you want to show them your new lunchbox? You see, we got a new one because I'm going to be eating more food at Kita, huh? You're going to be there for longer. Where are we going? To watch and play this. And then where are you going? To Kita. Let's go. Ready? Set. Set. Go. That's the best way to kick off Kita, huh? Okay, let's go get in the car seat. Well, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. That wasn't the easiest drop off and we had to leave with her crying in the arms of her new teacher, which was really hard and really sad to do. She's, she's going to do a great job. It's just going to take a little bit of time and that's okay. That's okay. And while I was at Kita, I used my time to work out and then either edit a YouTube video, read, or watch my favorite TV shows. Thanks to Surfshark, since moving from the States, I haven't had to miss out on any of my favorite American TV shows. Surfshark is an app and browser extension that basically lets you place your computer, phone, or TV that has internet anywhere in the world so you can access the internet as if you were actually in that country. This of course lets you access and unblock websites and content that you may not usually have access to. So for example, even though I live here in Germany, I can place my VPN settings to somewhere in the United States and still watch The Bachelorette, say on Hulu or ABC.com because I'm using Surfshark's VPN. And yes, I myself like to dabble into a little bit of dramatic reality TV shows here and there. We not only love and use Surfshark every day at home, but we use it when traveling. For example, when we travel outside of Germany, say to the United Kingdom, we can place our VPN settings to a place in Germany and then have access to the German Google version so we could search for local news and just stay up to date. The VPN also encrypts your online data to add an extra layer of security so anyone who tries to snoop on you won't be able to see what you're doing or where you're doing it from. You can use our code rstory to tell to get 83% off and three months free. Surfshark also offers a 30 day money back guarantee. So if it's not a perfect fit for you, there's no harm, you can get your money back and all is well. Go ahead and visit Surfshark or simply click the link in our description to learn more. What do you want to say? <laughs> <laughs> what does the chicken say? <laughs> what does the gato say? Chirky chirky. <laughs> what does the goat say? <laughs> well, how was Kita today, Willa? Um. So, next week, mm -hmm. I did cheek. And did you play with your friends? Yeah. Did you get some snacks? Mm -hmm. Right now we're lying underneath the trampoline for our afternoon activity. Today's a day off for me, so it's nice to get some one-on-one -on -one time with Willa. But when we picked her up, it was much better than we expected because when we left, she was pretty sad <laughs> to see us go. So we're looking forward to it. They said that she was a little sad until one of her best friends showed up. So we're really happy that they're in the same class and we're really excited because it's still great weather to enjoy lots of time outside and there are older kids in the class as well, which means that there's just going to be more and more growing. We're really excited for her to learn not only German, but just to learn how to play and interact with other kids. Overall, we're really excited and it's really nice because we don't have to go in or out when we drop her off or pick her up anymore. So. That's going to be kind of a nice thing, and we're really excited for her just to grow and make some good memories. Chica, chica, oh. 
Okay, let's close the door. Okay, you push it. Woo! What do you have? Where were you at? Kita. Do you love Kita? Yes. What do you do at Kita? Play. And what else? I sing. You sing songs? What songs do you sing? I sing. Kefa. And what do you do outside? So I play with my class on. And do you paint? Yes. I paint something and I draw something and I dance to that. Do you like your friends at Kita? Yes. A lot? Yes. And do you love your teachers? Yes. I love my teachers. This experience transitioning to a new Kita class has gone far better than I expected it to. Especially because my grandparents were here for those first two days that she attended Kita. I just didn't know if she would not want to go to Kita because she had family home or how that adjustment would go. And those days were not the easiest. We expected that just because entirely new faces. Unfortunately, after those first two days, the timing was as such where we had family in town and so we were doing a bit of traveling. We're trying to time the travels as such that she doesn't miss as much Kita but again it just lined up that way and being with family and having that one-on-one -on -one time with them is most important to us so she did miss about a week and a half of Kita and again I was a little apprehensive of how she would do going back after that break but both Tanner and I were quite surprised at how quickly she adjusted she must have remembered who her teachers were and her classmates and friends because she was much more comfortable going in that first day. Still, I wanna say she was like whimpering a little bit as I handed her off to the teacher, but after that, there's been like no sadness whatsoever. And in fact, she's like up early, she's ready fast, and she's like, hey mom, I'm ready, like, let's go. And I'm like, okay, we still have like 20 minutes until we have to leave. Sometimes we've had to drive the long way just because if she's ready to get in the car, I will take that and run with it. Tenor's also been able to drop her off and he's like, man, that girl like doesn't even turn around to say bye anymore. She basically gets down from her car seat, we walk over to the door, we ring in, whatever, get her backpack on, her teacher comes and she's just like, walks off and there's Tanner. See you, Willa. On she goes. She is ready for the day. And as much as that kind of hurts our heart a little bit, we wouldn't have it any other way. This girl is thriving. We have seen so much growth in just these past couple of weeks with her going to Kita. Like every day I'm like, oh my gosh, she's doing that? Like she is big. And I know you guys can't even see it through videos. Willa is just, she's growing up. I feel like it's like an accelerated pace now that she's in Kita. So every day we're just excited to hear what she did at Kita, what new fun German words she's learning, and how she's enjoying it. Nothing makes us happier than seeing her thriving and loving German Kita. So yay, this has just been such a fun video to make because really I feel like the challenges of adjusting abroad are just becoming easier and we're settling in. We should be by now, right? We've been here long enough, but you know, that adjustment with Kita has, has been difficult at times. I think the best is in front of us and we're already enjoying the process. Thanks so much for being here, you guys. We love having your support and we love just taking you with us on these adventures, whether it's traveling around Europe and doing the craziest things or just like kicking it at home and taking you with us to our day-to-day -day lives. We hope you're enjoying it as well. If you are, be sure to hit the like button and the subscribe button. We'll see you next time.